We make sure that democracy functions for the citizens of Roanoke County, and that's a huge responsibility, and we take it really seriously. This week is National Election Worker Appreciation Week, and we're standing out here in front of our Brambleton uh, polling place, where actually I had the opportunity to vote yesterday. Now, it might be more interesting to go inside, but there's lots of people voting today, and there's lots of rules in Virginia about uh, filming folks while voting, so just to uh, stay away from all that, we decided to shoot this outside. Uh, but as we go into election season and, and election day, I just want to thank all of the uh, really dozens and dozens and dozens of folks uh, across the county who whole job is either working with our elections or for most of them a part-time job during this season and appreciate the long hours they put in for uh, a function that's really uh, vital to the proper functioning of our democracy and our republic. A lot of people think, oh, you just work during the election. You just work, you know, starting maybe in August and work till November. It is not, it is work all year round. When I first started it, elections really wasn't that big of a deal. We didn't have that. We had people to vote, but not in the amount that we have nowadays. And you get to meet all kinds of interesting, wonderful people out there. I um, make sure that our voter rolls are daily kept up to date so that we have the most accurate uh, of rolls and information for everybody in Roanoke Valley. And uh, we um, also, during this season of early voting, we take care of all the people that come in to vote early. Uh, it's like having a, a voting day for 45 days instead of one. <laughs> but uh, the preparations start a little bit earlier now because of the open uh, voting or early voting. And I would say that um, it, it's probably a lot more work for the registrar and for the registrar's office. but. Uh, for the most part, everybody really, really likes early voting and the availability not to be standing in long lines on election day. It's not the easiest time at all to be in elections. It's actually much different than it was even five years ago. Um, but our staff is rising to the occasion and you know, working hard to deal with everybody in a polite and courteous manner making sure that they have the ability to exercise the right to vote. So, doing everything they can to do a good job. Well, I started out with this, it was more of a community service thing, working the polls. And as the years went by, I got more involved and really enjoyed working with the people. And then, of course, all the residents that come in to vote, it's wonderful. It's a great opportunity for them to, to come in and talk with us and see us and get to vote early. The the importance of the volunteers uh, can't be understated whatsoever. Uh, we would not be able to open our polls and have people vote on uh, election day without it. And uh, we have volunteers at work also when we have the uh, load of work at the elections office during the year for specific things uh, for the early voting and also for any primaries that happen in uh, the summertime. Voting is pretty much the most important thing you can do because it determines who represents you and how your money is spent. You know, you don't really have an option about paying taxes, but you do have an option about how it's there's going to be spent. And so, you know, we have a lot of people come in and, and they're upset because the president's not on the ballot this year. And we try to explain to them that you know, it's not the presidential elections that are really going to touch your everyday life. It's the local elections that are the most important elections. So, you know, that's what Roanoke County's got coming up next year. And we hope that people will turn out even though it's not a presidential year. We are a family here. We work very close. We work as a team. And I just love Roanoke County. So I hope you've enjoyed uh, getting the opportunity to, to hear from both uh, some of our full-time staff, our part-time folks who work in our elections office, as well as the volunteers who help us support our elections each and every election season. Uh, this is a vital right in our society and uh, just helps keep our democracy and our republic running well, and I just hope you really appreciate all that they do each and every year.